Uh, let's get into it. Now, the White House has confirmed that this Saturday, President Trump will travel to Philadelphia to attend the Army versus Navy college football game. Now, you already know Trump 100% considers this visiting the troops. <laughs> like, that's it, isn't it? I should say, by the way, Vice President Mike Pence won't be attending. Uh, it makes him uncomfortable to watch men in tight pants grabbing each other. <laughs> he won't do it. Moving on, we wanted to tell you about this. In Colorado, a nine-year-old boy has convinced his town to overturn an old law that banned snowball fights. Right? The snowball fights were banned in that town. Think of the tension that's been built up in that town <laughs> over the years. It's going to be a North Pole version of the perch. <laughs> How weird is Colorado, though? Marijuana was legalized before snowball fights. <laughs> People were like, oh, don't you dare, that's illegal. <laughs> you take a toad on this joint and you respect the law. <laughs> A nine-year-old boy convinced his town to lift the ban on snowball fights. I'm not entirely sure this is an appropriate message for kids. Like, do we really want children growing up thinking that government works? <laughs> <laughs> and finally, a town in Germany is divided over the issue of one woman's livestock. Apparently, this lady puts cowbells on her cows and she's getting complaints that the bells are too loud. I mean, it sounds like those neighbours... Uh, sounds like those neighbours have beef. <laughs> Thanks. I wrote that. This town is so divided, the cows have decided to defend themselves, OK? Today, the cows brought in their own reinforcements. Here he is here. 